Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of Crime and Justice Report on Pinnacle TV. My name is Glory Irubo. On this week's episode, we are bringing you the trending story of um, the murder and death of Super TV boss Michael Osifo Ataga. He's a billionaire who was murdered sometime last week um, in Lekki by a 21 year old mass communication student. This is um, another sad story. You see, we keep on getting sad stories in this country. May so rest in peace and may he get justice. And my heartfelt condolence to his beautiful wife, Miss Brenda, and his kids. May God give them the fortitude to bear the loss. Chidima Ojuku, a 21-year-old 300-level Unilag mass communication student, has revealed why he killed Michael Usifu Ataga, a 50-years-old chief executive officer of Super TV. According to the Lagos State Commissioner of Police, Hakim Odumosu, Chidima conspired with some other persons who are currently now at large to carry out the crime. He stated this while parading the suspect at the police headquarters in Lagos. Speaking with journalists, Chidima revealed that she has been in a romantic relationship with the late Ataga for about four months. She also narrated how she stabbed him with a knife after a struggle, which eventually led to his death. She further confessed to have taken the knife away while leaving the scene and disposed same in a dustbin at her residence. She debunked the initial claim that she withdrew 5 million naira from the deceased account but admitted to withdrawing 380,000 naira using his ATM card. He gets me, was stopping me. That's how we went. What we about? He was stopping me. He even locked the door. I, it was really key. He locked the door. I didn't know where he kept the key. So I, when I get to the door, he draw me back. And that, that was what happened. The, the, the first one was both. The first one was twice. The instance, the first one on on the next side. That was the first one. And then when when I stabbed him the, the first one twice, I threw the knife on the bed. Then he was going for it while I went for it. So while I laid on the bed, that's when it came on me to to hold the knife and that's when I managed to stab him with the knife and then he, and then when he dragged the knife on me, he managed to slice my hand and then as he was holding it, the knife broke so it slipped off from his hand I still managed to help, help to it but then it was now weak and then Okay, so what, what did you like? What was it about the first time that you did like? What did you do? To you? Or what happened? I was, I was, I was trying to, I was sleep, I was trying to sleep. It was midnight, so we were drunk and we had um, smoked, so I was already like sleeping. And then, Continue. and then I was already sleeping, and then when he came and I was that was what happened. He was he was surrounded and locked. What kind of smoke? What did you guys smoke? It was SK loud. How was it? SK and loud. Was there weed in the room? That's weed now. It's not. It's not. How were you outside? They came to my house. And that's how I was Okay, do you live with your parents? Where? Okay, how long have you known this guy and how did you meet him? Exactly. Exactly. Uh, I've known him for four months, five months. I met him too for me. I tried to introduce him to you. Yeah. Okay, so how regular do you think this? Not regular. Not regular. Okay, that's what I'm not doing. Okay, so how long? How long did you guys stay? Did you check in on Sunday? When did you die? Which day did you die? And when did you leave him? And how were you able to escape from the room after killing him or you just walked in? Well, why why was 
line there I just I changed and then I left the I looked for the key for where it ate it and I left it there. So when you escaped who did you reach out to? Where was the first place you went to? I didn't reach out to anybody. So how do you feel when you know that you have killed somebody and you just sneaked out? How do you feel at twenty one? Committing this, this kind of crime. What did you do with the ATM letter? Which is ATM? I do some armor. How much? And I'll be two eighty. On confirm reports have you that in your original account you have about 10 million naira. How did you get such amount of money? So how was it traced to you? It's not true. After this come? I don't Card. Chidima was tracked and arrested at her parents' residence at Yaba, Lagos during a search on their place. A blood-soaked cloth, ostensibly worn on the day of the incident, was discovered. It has been reported that Chidima's father has been arrested for initially resisting the arrest of Chidima at their residence. Also, the late Michael Osifo Ataga was married to Miss Brenda, who was said to be a managing director at NNPC. Wow, what a sad one here again. Ah. May they find peace, more those involved find peace, and may the family of uh, Michael Osifo Ataga get justice for this. Okay, this is all we can take on today's episode of Crime and Justice Report on Pinnacle TV. Please, if you've not subscribed to this channel, subscribe, share, tell somebody about Pinnacle TV and continue to enjoy the goodies that comes with Pinnacle TV.